Hi, so in this video I am going to show you four Makaton signs. Actually, I'm going to show you five Makaton signs. So I'm going to show you a Makaton sign for food, but I'm going to show you two different signs for food. So you can choose which one you use, but whichever one you choose, you must use that one consistently um, so that they get to recognise that one sign. But I'll show you two so you can make your choice on which one you feel is easier or more appropriate for you. Um, I'm going to show you the Makaton sign for more, um, the Makaton sign for bath or bath time and the Makaton sign for sleep or bed, bedtime. Um, a really simple one to use for that. So we'll start with bed or bedtime, sleep as the first one. Really simple. You put both of your hands together and you put them at the side of your face and you just lean your head on your hands as if you were going to sleep. So you would go, oh, it's bedtime. It's bedtime. So that can be used for kind of bedtime, sleep, um, again, but consistently use that one. Um, the one for bath or bath time is you put both of your hands together as if you were holding on to some taps and you just turn them as if you're turning the taps on a bath. So you'd go, oh, it's bath time. Let's go and have a bath. It's bath time. So that's another really easy one to do. The sign for more, what you do is you take your non-dominant hand, you put it in a fist, you then take your dominant hand, you keep it flat and you put it on top of your fist like that. So you would go, would you like some more? Would you like some more? Okay, now onto the two for food. So there are two for food, well, one's for food, one's for dinner, but they can be used for snack and meal times, um, either one of them. So the one for food is you take your dominant hand, you put your fingers together, almost like a little puppet, and then you just tap the side of your mouth. So that's food, food. So that could be used and you could say, oh, snack time, it's dinner time. Are you hungry? Would you like something to eat? So that's quite a nice, easy one to use. And that can be used for all of them. Or the other one that is used sometimes is where you put two fingers together on each hand, your first two fingers together, and you mime actually eating. So it's dinner time, it's breakfast time, it's snack time, let's have something to eat. So it's whichever you feel more comfortable with. Quite often a lot of our children find this one really easy because it's one hand, it's by their mouth, so it's where they'd be putting the food in. So it's quite an easy one to, to start with in <gasps> food, something to eat. So um, they are the two that you could use. But as I said, to start with, when you first start out with something like Makaton, just pick one of the two and consistently use that one. So I hope that helps you with your Makaton signing.